The initiative has been generated by the fishing industry together with governments to seize the opportunity to look afresh at how we manage inshore fisheries in the UK. Getting the different sort of stakeholders uh, who are involved in the fishing industry around the table working together is an essential part of the whole co-management process which can then help to shape a pathway to uh, future success. This workshop is preparation for uh, the wider conference that we'll be holding in October. What I don't want is a, a report that, just, like many others on the fishing industry, that just gathers dust. I'm very keen that the conference in October isn't um, uh, an end point, it's a starting point. We wanted to use the workshop today to make sure that we focus that conference event on the right issues. And I think what we've got from today is some really good dialogue, some great suggestions and a very clear steer on what, the, on what the important issues are when it comes to fixing the problem of how do we improve our inshore fisheries management. We've got Brexit coming down the tubes, we've got fisheries bill, we've got DEFRA very much in listening and proactive mode. So this is particularly timely in bringing all those threads together, hopefully to develop a new regime for inshore fisheries management. I think the October event, the conference is, you know, if you're not in the room, you're nowhere. Whoever can get there should be there because this will define policy to a large extent, I think, for years to come. DEFRA is very pleased to be uh, co-sponsoring this event. It's a really great opportunity to give us uh, all a toolbox of things that we can use to manage fisheries more effectively in future. And we're really keen on the project to engage with as many fishermen and wider stakeholders as possible about the future direction of inshore fisheries really welcome everyone's engagement in this project. It's a wonderful opportunity for people to put their points of view across and discuss with others about what their hopes are for the future of inshore fisheries management and really encourage people to be involved. Having everybody involved is extremely important. I mean, I always talk about good governance and part of that is inclusiveness and openness and transparency. I think this is an ideal time to include the fishermen and others in shaping the future in terms of putting in intelligent and adaptive uh, fisheries management regimes. I think if we're talking about sort of co-management going forward, then it's essential that government, the regulators are in the room with industry um, so that people can understand the potential consequences of management decisions. What I'm seeing today is genuine listening and I think uh, appreciation from um, government officials um, across devolved administrations. It's vital that we get real fishermen um, at these events. I'm the paid help. I'm the pen pusher, uh, but it's important given the, the unique position that we're in, the unique position that Brexit presents us with really to get this inshore fishery right, I want to see the fishermen involved, the real fishermen and not the paid help like me.